Good morning. Welcome back to another video. This is actually going to be my first um, photo card um, storing slash um, binder reorganizing video. Um, and I, I'm actually hoping to finish a lot of things in this video because my binders and my collection is all over the place right now. There are a lot of like housekeeping things that I need to do and I know some of them I should have done off camera just to give this video more structure or more organization but like what's the point of doing an organization video if I'm doing most of the organizing off cam? So a lot of things that I want to do I'm just gonna like try and put um lay it all down so at least I have like like a guideline of what I want to do. So basically, I have three binders here for my three alts. I have Jomu, Winwin, and Suho. And then I have here a miscellaneous um, binder that I just use for like other things that I collect that are not my alts. And then I'm actually doing, I'm actually planning on collecting other um groups and other members uh, that's also one thing that i need to do i need to set up some binders as well so without further ado i think we can get started so i know i want to do the big binders first like the nine pocket ones oh my god uh, can you even see okay i think i think you can see the whole thing right so i'm planning on doing the big binders first so I have two big binders here. This like these two binders actually used to be my main binders before I got the A5 binders. But this used to be my alts binder. As you can see, I still have like the filler um sheets. And this is my miscellaneous binder where I just put like things that I am collecting that are not my alts. And these ones are just like for fun. And I'm planning on reusing them for a different type of, um, for a different group slash member, I'd say. The smaller one I'm planning on using as my, like, my miscellaneous binder. So this one is where I would put my dream. Um, like sometimes I tend to collect OT7 dream, but it depends on the era and it depends on the photo cards like i'm not going to be collecting ot7 for the whole era like i would just pick like a line of photo cards that i like and that's what i'm collecting like for instance for hello future i decided that i wanted to collect the dream agent version um photo cards so that one i would consider as a miscellaneous and then those ones i'm gonna put in this like thinner i think this is half an inch and then this big one, I am planning on setting up for Triple S. Because Triple S doesn't really have a lot of albums out right now. But I know it's just gonna, it's just about to get worse from here. So this one I'm planning on using for Triple S. So I guess I'll start with removing the sheets over here. Okay, so I guess I'll stop here. So far I have about 10 black um mt9 pockets i think that's enough for triple s because again they don't really have a lot of albums out right now and then so basically i recently just decided to um collect them and i am collecting basically all the photo cards for each era which is probably not the best idea and I am aware of that. I'm probably going to downsize my collection in the near future. But for now, I'll just have fun and go crazy. Anyways, so let's see. La Seraphim. Oh my god, speaking of La Seraphim, come on. The album was so good. Um, Honestly, I'd say that it's not their best. Like, sonically, like the songs or the tracks... And basically just the whole new track list of songs. It's not their strongest one. I still think Anti-Fragile is their best. But in terms of even the title track, I wouldn't say it's their best title track. But just like the whole package of like the concept, the sound, it's just everything. Anyways, okay, going back to Triple S, I am 
going to open this one, which is their um, Acid Angel from Asia photo cards. As you can see, I basically only have two here because I only bought two albums, just one of each version, and you get one each. And I have 16 that I need to collect, uh, about 14 more to go. So for Triple S, their subunits, I'm kind of like effy about how I would want to position it in a nine pocket binder because there's four members so I can do like one two three four in each page but that's gonna take I think too much so that's gonna about take like if I do that way I'm probably gonna use up um, about four sheets just for one album and I kind of want to maximize as much as I can but what else can I do do though i was thinking about like what if i put because it's 16 cards so i can do eight and eight and so that way it's like you know um not wasteful but if i do eight and eight then that means i'm gonna have to do either um this pattern where it's like around and then there's like a block here which is kind of weird because it's for members so if i do that it's gonna be two like one member but like like, it's just awkward, if you know, it, like, it just looks awkward. Or, what I could do is, I could probably do, like, just a normal, like, 08, and then leave a blank here. Or, I could do 8, and then leave a blank here. I'd say for now, let's do that, since I don't really have a lot of cards here. Um, it's kind of still hard to tell for me, like, how, how, how those cards are going to look like. Um, I have like filler sheets here. These ones I just literally printed myself and cut um, because I don't want to be like buying white sleeves just for fillers. I feel like that's too wasteful and they also cost money so I just don't see the point. Okay, so let's see. I'm thinking that, okay, I'll do a like a block here and then for the next one I'm gonna do like a block at in the beginning so it's like kind of balanced like here and then I'm not gonna be like very specific about how I want to position the members I'm probably just going to position them however so if I'm doing eight and eight I think, let's see. Okay, so looking at this, yes, so looking at this, 207 and 208 are basically like kind of similar in terms of like what it looks like and the concept. And then 209 and the two tens also kind of look same. So I think I'm gonna split like this. So these, like this eight, like 207, 208 for the four members on the first page. And then I'll do 209 and then 210 for the four members in here. So that's gonna be two, four, six. Okay, that's also one thing with um, the nine pocket. Like it's why I feel like it's awkward because it's gonna be like, let's say I do Hidden, hidden, yuyon, yuyon. And it's gonna be awkward because there's gonna be one member here that's just like by by herself and then just her photo card by herself again. And then, yeah, so let's do like hidden and then one member on like by themselves, one member by themselves, and then two and then two. So it looks awkward. So maybe how I'd wanna do it is I'll do like four members and then just four members again. And then I'll go, I'll probably just follow this template for now since yet yeah, like again, I don't really have the photo cards in person to tell how they would look like. So I guess the best I can do is like, I'll, I'll just go like Heren, Yuyun, Nakyong, Yubin, and then just repeat the pattern and then same here. So I'm probably what, how I'm gonna do it is, I'm not sure, should I fill out yeah, I'm thinking if I should still put the sheets here, but yeah, I'll say I'll put them for now, just for placeholders. 
Okay, so if I do 207, so it goes Heren, 207 Yuyon, 207 Nakyong. And then, good thing I have Yubins. In here, I believe. Okay, as you can see, like I said earlier, this is gonna be pretty disorganized. I don't even have my cards sleeved. Like, these are the sleeves I got from the trades where I got them from. So, you've been. Okay, I guess I'll separate the triple S cards that I have. Got two Yubins. And actually, for my assemble, um, the assemble photo cards, these ones, there are about 20 cards because there were two versions of e uh, for each member. There's 10 members for this comeback, and then two version each, so that's 20. And I'm, I th believe I am only, let me see. Okay, I guess I don't have it here, but on my Instagram, I think I'm only missing about two, like two cards. Okay, so I'll go back to this triple S, Acid Angel, and then again, I'll go um, Heren 207, Yuyon 207, Nakyung 207. Or what if I do like hidden, like all Heron in here, four, and then all Yuyon, and then the next one is Nakyo and Yubin. No, I think what it, like the original one that I was planning, I think that's a better idea. At least you get like a glimpse of all the members in one page. Yeah, so I'll go 207, 207, 207, and then Yubin 207, which is this one. Um, this one isn't sleeved yet. I got like the outer sleeve, but I need to double sleeve it. This is probably gonna be so long, like this video. But honestly, I don't mind. Like, I'm actually a fan of longer videos. I like watching longer videos and just like having them um, play in the background as I'm doing something. Oh, no, 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 not here. Here. Okay, the thing I don't like about the sleeves that I'm using is because they're on, they fit photo cards really well, like as you can see, but because of that, in nine pocket binders, they tend to move a lot. And then, so I got 207, 207, 207, and I actually have some sticky notes here that I can write on just so I know which word, like, where things go. Oh my god, I'm so unprepared. I'm literally doing this as I'm doing the video. But who cares? It's my channel, my rules. Okay guys, I changed my mind. My handwriting is kind of bad. Should I even do this though? Okay, I'll do it. Head in 207. Um, I'm just gonna put it outside. I don't wanna put it inside because that's too much work. You know what? Since I have colors here, what if I just use like um, specific color for a member so I can just go like green is for like this uh, lime I guess yellow um, colors for head in and then let's do you on and then not young and then I'll just put 207 so I know so it's also like easier okay good thing these are cheap actually I got them from Dollarama and as you can see you get a lot Okay, and I got Yubin, and then we'll go 208 Heren. And then 208 Yuyon. Speaking of Triple S, they actually released Aesthetic today. So that's Triple S Crystallize. I still haven't seen like what the photo cards look like because I haven't seen a template yet. But just on the first listen of the album it's very much giving um it's giving luna one third but make it triple s 
and I say that as a compliment because Luna One Third discography is honestly god tier, and that's I'd say Crystallize. I really like their sound. To wait. And green cherry talk sounds so so good i couldn't have asked for a more like a better title track to eat to eat and i'm already praying for my wallet for their next comeback because their next subunits evolution and lavolution they have eight members in each um subunit and just judging by like how they've been releasing their albums, if they're releasing two photo cards for each member, that means there's going to be <sighs> 16 photo cards per album. And basically that's like 32 in total for that cycle. Honestly, it's not actually not that bad if you compare it to like other groups. Say like I know twice has a lot like even 17 I saw their photo cards for their previous comeback and um just looking at it makes me kinda wanna die. So to all my carrot subscribers, followers, <laughs> I salute y'all because like I don't know how you guys do it. Like that's just too much. Especially if you collect POBs too, like come on. Like just the like the album photo cards alone. I actually wanted to faint because I saw it on my Twitter, like on my timeline on Twitter, and I was literally like gagged. Like I could not believe that. Oh, sorry. Let me center this. Yeah, I can't believe that companies actually do that. And then considering that they have twenty three mem, no, not <laughs> not me turning that into NCT. And with them with like thirteen members, that's like ins an insane amount of photo cards. Oh my god. Genuine question, do some of y'all like, like, carrot collectors here? Like, do you know, or are you, like, do you know someone, or do you personally collect OT13? I'm just, like, curious, because how do you do that? Like, that's insane. Okay. So, this one is the block, and then we're doing, we're doing in 209s and 210s. So, it goes head in. 209, Yulian 209, Nakim 209, Yubin 209, which I have. And I think this one is already double sleeve. Nope. I have to double sleeve it still. I'll put it there. The only thing I don't like about double sleeving is because there's so much layers that sometimes like it like on camera if you see it. The photo card is just kind of like reflective of the light. Like you can't really see the photo card properly. Uh, just one thing that I don't like. Okay, I'll do the post-it. So that's yellow for heading, pink for Yuyan, green for Nakyang. And then I don't need orange for Yubin. And then I'll just do it the exact same. I probably won't be able to do this for OT20 though. You know what? My speaking of triple S, you know what? I need to stick to like whatever group I'm doing. I need to stick to that topic because I feel like I'm just going all over the place. My uh, okay, so when I was new to Triple S, I actually started standing during before. Oh, I started standing just before um, Axis, so before Triple A's debut. Okay, all right, 209. And during that time, when they were oh my god, I already messed up, and when they were releasing the teasers. I was so excited because just the highlight medley from the concept videos, it already sounded and looked great. And then I didn't really start watching like the signals until, let me see, 210. Oh my God, I messed up. This is 210. Yeah, I didn't really start watching the signals until I'd say a month in after Triple A's debut. 210. And in 
when I was watching the music video and like watching their stages, Yubin was actually the one who caught my attention. So she's technically my first triple S bias, you could say. And then I started watching the Signal Weeklies. I still haven't finished them actually. I'm not even close to catching up because I only watch them when like I feel like watching them. I think right now I'm I'm on the part where Yuyan was already introduced. So only S5 and we're at what? S14 now? Okay, so that's for Axis. Now let's do... Okay, we'll move on to Assemble. I actually let... I actually prefer doing Assemble over Axis because I don't know, just like looking at the cards here, there's too many. I know there's m much more here, but here it's like literally four for just one member. This one, it's not too bad because I actually have, have a lot of them on the way. Right now I have about three. And then I'm just waiting for like my, uh, I think I ordered 16, either 16 or 14. And I believe I am only missing, I think this one. Wait, I'm gonna like go to my Instagram real quick just to see. Okay, so this is the one they posted on Instagram. As you can see, like I'm only missing one. So I guess I have about, if I have three, I'm only, yeah, I have 16 on the way and I'm only missing this Yuyan uh, photo card. And I have most of it on the way. I actually bought all of them from one, person which is insane like that's actually insane to have that good of a look where you can get basically 99% of your collection from one person because if like I know some of y'all here are on Instagram collecting and selling you know how it's so annoying having to buy slash trade for your collection with multiple people because just like the effort of messaging of taking videos of like packing and doing that multiple times just to reach like a certain point in your collection it's too much work but for this one like having everything basically everything i needed um and then just buying it from one person it saved me so much time and honestly it saved me so much money like the amount that i transferred was of course it's big because there's so many photo cards here there were 16 but if you look at it in the perspective where it's like if I do it one by one, like I get one card from different types of people, that's gonna be extra PayPal fees, extra shipping fees, extra whatever, right? So I'd say this is like better. Um. Anyways, okay, I'll go, hmm, let's see. I'll do 207 then 208 because that just, ma like, that just makes sense. This one is where I'm going to struggle because they have 10 members, so I can't do like 9 here and then just 1 on the next one. So I need to split them up. I'm thinking 5, 5, 5, 5. So that's going to use up about 4 pages. And I'm thinking of doing like first an X pattern and then a cross. So like a cross pattern and then an X. And I want to do it like alternating. So it's like cross X, cross or should I do like, yeah, I'll do cross X, cross X. I think that would be cute. And then I'll just go like by um, S numbers. So like, Soyeon, S1, Hidden, Ju, like, I'll just do it like that. So it's not that more, like, I don't want to overcomplicate it. Okay, I'm probably going to fast this forward. I don't want to keep on talking because it's going to be too long if I do this on camera. Okay. So I figured that because I, like, just to save some time, I'm probably not going to put, like, if there's a card going in there, I'm probably not going to put a filler. So I'm just going to leave, like, the blocks. And then I'm just going to put, like, the post-it notes outside so I know, like, what member goes where. So I just, like, at least I can save, like, some, uh, like, filler sheets and also save some time. I'm thinking... I might not do like order um, members in order because 
I just realized that okay I don't know if I said this yet but when they started watching the signal videos Soyeon actually became my bias um I know like uh oh so predictable because she's S1 but it's just like I really love her personality and I appreciate that she's very much like a blank canvas in terms of like a trainee slash idol like she can improve and she does improve and she has like great amounts of potential like she's yeah like i said like she's like a blank canvas like she could easily become a dancer if she wanted to she can easily become a singer if she wanted to unlike the other members where it's like in a way they're they're already in the industry either as a model an actress or are an already existing idol or like basically a trainee already in the system soyeon i really like yeah i just like i'm very much rooting for her and i really love her personality and i <laughs> not me going on to like why i love soyeon ren but i am saying this because i am i'm i realized that if i do it in order it's just gonna be like the exact same like members on the same spot and i kind of want to move it around so I want to move Soyeon in the middle and then I'll probably put Jiu here for now because Soyeon is my bias. I'll put there, I put her there. But uh, the four, the, like the four corners here, they're still probably going to move. Um, it depends on like how well the photo cards look together. But I know for a fact Soyeon's going to be in the middle. Okay, so right now I'm actually just leaving Sumin, sleeving Sumin here because I actually have her and because she's S6, I'll put her here. So this one is gonna be an X and it'll go such a, oh, it, it'll, no, this one's a cross, sorry. And then in terms of like how I wanna position like the middle here, because Soyeon is not, I mean, she's S1. And so this one's gonna be S6 to 10. Again, like I said earlier, Yubin actually was my first triple S bias. So I decided to put her in the middle. So it's gonna go um, like normal. So it's gonna be Soomin, Nakyong, because S6, 7, Nakyong, S8, which is gonna be Yubin, and then this one is gonna be Kate, and then this one's going to be Dahyun. Okay, on to the next page. This is going to be S. No, not S, sorry. Two. So this one's 207. Like these two are 207. This one's gonna be these two are 208. And I'll just do the. Maybe I should switch it up. So since I did for like s1 to s5 i did um x uh, like an x pattern i'll probably do a cross here okay again because soyeon's my bias i'll put her in the middle um i'll just need to double sleeve this this one i actually did not pull i think this one i bought and i bought it for like not like, that expensive because the card, like, it was already scanned. So, I'll put Soyeon in there. And then I'll just do, like, instead of S1 here, I'll do S1 here. And then 2, 3, 4, 5. So, it's just gonna be, like, Heren, Jiwoo, um, Jeon, and then... you. Oh, good thing I have Yuyeon here. And then I'll do an X for this. Okay, and then... I guess that's it for triple S. So, um, I guess I'll move on to the next. Uh, so this one's gonna be my triple S binder and I'll do my miscellaneous binder. Miscellaneous binder. Um, I think I have some of the miscellaneous collection in this binder where I'm planning on putting my girl group. Um, Cards. So my miscellaneous binder would be, um, I think these are the expansion, yeah, don't fight the feeling expansion cards, dream agent cards, and then these ones are not really a collection, more so like I just wanted to put them in a, like, 
a binder. <laughs> so these are like the season's greetings, uh, 2022, 127. And then these ones I think are Christmas Evil um, pre-order cards. And then I also got like a bunch of here. Um, I'll probably gonna like, I don't know what I'm gonna do with these, but okay. So I guess I'll move my miscellaneous in here. I'll take this out. So I'll use my iPad here. So this is gonna be my first like miscellaneous. Um, here I'm trying to like center there so this is gonna be like my like the first page so I, i'll do it by age so i think this is already double sleeve so it's gonna be min so i still don't have baekhyun's and then we'll do chanyeon and then i have the old wait yeah, never mind. I got it right. <laughs> I was like, wait, is Dio older than Chanyo? No, he is not. Because Dio is 93. And then Chanyo is 92. And then we got Kai and Sehun. Wait, I just realized there's only six of them here. I don't want to put them like this and then have all of this like blocks. Wait, how should I do it? Should I do it like this? Or... Two, two, and two. Wait, I'll do the cute um thing. So I'll do Min Sok here, Baekhyun, and then Chanyeon, and then we'll go Dio, Kai, Seon, and I'm just gonna put the blocks. Oh my god, I've been filming for like an hour now. And I'm literally only on my second binder. I have so much to go through. Um, here. And then on the corner here, I'm gonna put... Back. Okay, that's, that's EXO. And then another miscellaneous collection that I have is... Let's see. This one. NCT 127... No, not 127. NCT Dreams. Dream Agent cards, which I'm gonna put on here. So there's seven. How should I do this? So I have nine. So I'm gonna have two like fillers. Yeah, I think I'll just do it like this. So I don't wanna overcomplicate it. So I'll do it like this, where it's like block and block, and then I'll just go like by age. So I think, yes, I already have Mark. And I think Jimin's is on the way. If I'm right. Um, I forgot. Um, Mark is here. And then I think the rest I have in the binder. Wait, so that's two, three, four, five, six. And I think these are already fully. Uh, no, except Mark. Mark is not double sleeved yet. So we got this cute mark card. Um, I'll sleeve it. Okay, so we'll go by age. So I'll put mark in here. And then... Vengeon. I'm actually in love with this card. Like this Vengeon card. And then... Geno. I'll skip Gemins because I think it's on its way. Not my thing, I know it's on its way. Uh, and then we got Janba and Jisong. And I guess we're just missing Jemin. Got that. So just waiting for Jemin. And um, I, this one is also miscellaneous. I'm probably not going to set this up one yet. Geno, like I have one Geno here. But he's on the back of my phone right now. And I'm using it to film. And then I am still missing like about six. So I'll save a, sh like, a pa like I'll save a page. But I won't set it up yet. See, this one is already set up as you can see. Like the blocks there so i'm just gonna leave it like that and then i don't i don't think i need to put like the post-it because it's just my age now we'll want to move on to 
I'm pretty sure I have another NCT Dream Miscellaneous here. So I'm also collecting NCT Dreams um, photo book, but candy photo book cards. Um, this one, same thing. I only have one member. I only have Mark. And then the rest, I still don't have. This one, I'm probably gonna set up now. Um, the only reason I didn't want to set up the, the uh, like the first, NCT Dream the first, yeah, is because Geno is on the back of my phone. And I don't want to like take it right now. But this is going to be NCT Dream yet again. And let me see if I have his card here. I should. But let me just... Oh, it's literally right there. I think this is double... No, it's not double sleeve yet, but I'll double sleeve it. And I'll put them here. And I'm still missing six. <laughs> it's okay. It's like my miscellaneous collection is literally just for fun. Like, I'm not taking it seriously. It's only like when I feel like, oh, I'm not really collecting. Like, my collection is fine and I kind of want to still trade. I'm... Um, that's when that's the only time i work on my miscellaneous collection now i'm probably gonna use two more yeah two more pages i'm gonna use it for nct no not nct i'm gonna use it for yeah nct 127 and stray kids and this one i'm literally just gonna transfer it from my binder like my a5 binder this one it won't even consider a collection because they literally give you a set when you buy it but i just want like because i'd rather have it on a, in a binder than have it like just sitting in a container okay this one i'm gonna do by age so since Hatchin is already here and the thing i like about 27 because there's nine of them i don't need to fill any fillers and it's also satisfying to have like nine cards wait so these are not double sleeve Johnny. Okay, got that. See, you see what I mean when it's like satisfying when it's like a whole like you fill up the whole page, and then I'll do Stray Kids. Stray Kids is eight. Always have been. I don't know what you're talking about. Um, so I'm gonna have to use a filler. I'll put it on here. And then this one, I'm also gonna do my age. These cards, I've actually contemplated selling before, but I'm like, I don't think I can let them go. They're just too cute. These ones are not double sleeved. I wonder, hmm, should I double sleeve them? No, I think it should be fine. I'm not gonna double sleeve these cards. They're pre-order benefits, like, come on. Let me tell you about the seraphim. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. So good. So good. Let me tell you about the seraphim. Like, I, oh my god. Like, look at them. Like, all these photo cards are so cute. Like, I'm actually, I, I feel blessed to have all, all of them. Like, they don't look so. Um, I don't think I've ever talked about Stray Kids here. I actually used to stand Stray Kids, but I wasn't like a big stand. I was just like casually standing. I bought like about four albums, and Lena was my bias. My cinnamon bun. Cutie, patootie, baby bun bun. Um, and then So Min is also one of my biases. So two of them. And I think that is all for my miscellaneous binder. Now we move on to my alt binders. So my alts actually are... I kind of expanded. It used to be just three men. Now there's an improvement because I have girl groups too so this one is going to be my girl group binder for now i think it'll do pretty well like like zipper pretty cute flower zipper and like the, i love the color it's like glittery too like it's just so slayful and i'm planning on so I'm collecting for girl groups and collecting Chewon. You would you would consider a triple S as a girl group, but because there's so many cards, I had to put them in the nine pocket. If it was just Soyon, I would probably just put her here. But anyways, I'll put Chewon and Hani in here. So let's see. So I'm going to do just Hani. And 
I actually recently unboxed some new jeans albums on my channel if you want to watch that but I also got some tiny photo parts from those so we got that and I'll just go literally the laziest way out I'll go by order so just how I see it here is how it's gonna be on here but I think yes so there's about two four six seven there's about 14 cards for new jeans and then two four six seven and then two four five there's about 16 here and then 14 cards for omg oh sorry other way around 14 and then this one's 12 right two four six seven and then five so i think yeah i'll probably break it by yes i'll break it by um what do you call it by era so i'll do like the four and then that's like four for how many was it against 14 so they're like four eight twelve and then two here and i'm gonna put two fillers and then it's gonna be omg era okay let's do that and i don't have most of these but I do have, I don't have the blue book, blue book, I don't have the blue book versions, but I have these ones. So I got bag. So I need to skip seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then it's going to be the bag card. This one's already double sleeved, thank God. And then it's going to be Weaver's A, which I don't think I got because I think I got Weaver's B. Yes, I got Weaver's B. So bag is good. And then I go skip, skip. Yeah, I go one, two, three, four. I need to skip four. So one, two, three, four. It's like playing Monopoly. <laughs> and then the two here. So this and this. And then I'll sleeve those. I think, yeah. The new jeans ones, the new jeans cards are kind of bad for me because I didn't really get a lot of their albums. I got like the bag version and then the weavers, but that's it. But for OMG, I have their weavers. I have the message card, um, but I got Minji's. Or was it hidden? I think I got Minji's. Yeah, I got Minji's. Oh, need to double sleeve. And then the rest, I'm probably just gonna trade for. Um, should I be talking? I kind of don't know what to talk about. Um, yeah, <laughs> I'll probably just shut up here. Okay, now I'm gonna put like, I don't know if these are gonna fit though. Cause these ones are for the bigger nine pocket pages. <gasps> they fit. But I think barely there oh no 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 i don't like that it does that you're out i think i have a few filler sheets that are made for that size here um this one's kind of awkward but i'll use this one I'll use that for as a placeholder, but I don't like the cut because it looks uneven, but I'll just use that for now. Just so there's just like a filler there. Okay. OMG, it's New Jeans message card. Um, I have that. And then this with honey message card. I do not have that one. And then let's see. The first four, I only have those two. So these are not full on sleeved yet because the sleeves here are the ones that I got from the trade. 
I also, you know what? Even though I'm not a, like a big fan of the glossy ones, what I like about New Jeans cards is they seem pretty thick. Okay, I got those two from her message cards. I'm still missing three. No, I'm missing... No, this is the New Jeans message card. And then four honeys. So one... No, five honeys. One, two, three, four, five. And move on to the Weavers cards. Weavers A. Which I think I have. And then... Reverse A again, uh, which is, I don't have as well. And I actually got a dupe because I, I think I traded this with someone and this one I got from my own Reverse album. So I need to just re-sleeve this. And then it goes Weavers albums, basically all Weavers. And then it goes Weavers A, this one. And another Weavers A, which I don't have. And I think B and C, I have both. So B and C. B and C. I'm still missing one more C. You know what? It's I think it, it it's so easy to collect like one member for new jeans because they're doing like the five, like they're doing sets. But I think if you do like if you collect OT5, I think it's gonna just gonna be like about as hard as if you're collecting one member from a group like NCT where it's like just one card each. Wait, did I put it right? No, 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 no. It's here because this is Weaver's B. I'm not gonna put fillers anymore or even a label because I think for me, it's just gonna be like common sense where it's gonna go. As long as I have my template with me, or like as I'm doing this, I think I won't be lost. The next time that I do this, I'm probably gonna pre-sleeve my cards and do a more organized like storing video as you can tell it's already getting darker so my lighting is kind of getting weirder as well <laughs> okay and then that's it for honey we'll move on to my biggest nightmare chen Wan. not her but her cards because i heard that lesser film is expensive as hell and i am not thrilled at all i only have one card so for Chewan, I guess for Fearless, she has two photo cards and then four for the monochrome bouquet. Well, that's not too bad. So I guess it'll go like two regular and then four monochromes. And then it's going to be skipped because it's a new era. Anti-Fragile, I think, is everybody's worst nightmare, especially her. This freaking card, I saw how expensive it is and how hard it is to get. And I'm actually going to go insane. Like, I'm not even kidding you. Um, okay, let's see. I only have this one. Her Weaver's... Card. I, wait, I think it was this one. I actually am just waiting for my Unforgiven albums. Um, I'm not sure when they're about to ship. They should be shipping soon because it was released on Monday and it's already Thursday. Okay, that's level sleeved. I just need to figure out how I want to do it. So I'm probably just going to do it by order. I don't want to like complicate things. Um, that's like my go-to, just do things in order of like the template I'm following. So I'll do volume one, two, three, and then compact. So for compact, you get one, two, three, four. You get four photo cards. So I guess we'll go one, two, three, and then one, two, three, four. No, wait, that's kind of awkward. Wait, what if I do it like this though? Okay, I think I, I, I think I know how I want to do it. Because there's two, four, six, seven, two, four, 
five. There's 12 cards. I could do volume one, two, wait, I'll move this. Volume one, volume two, volume three. And then I'll do a unit. And then four compacts, one, two, three, four, because there's four compacts. And then for weavers, we'll do weavers, weavers, weavers. No, weavers, weavers, QR, and then a unit again. I think, yeah, I think that would be cute. So I guess for weavers, we'll I put this here. And then I'm not gonna put any like um, fillers. So that's Chewan. And then for Unforgiven, I'm probably gonna do the exact same thing, but one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So I'll probably do. Let's see. What if I do for Unforgiven? Same thing. Volume one, two, and three, and then I'll do her, like the mirror selfie. And then let's do. No, you know what? Wait, let me see. Is the mirror selfie considered as a photo book, photo card, or a compact? I'm guessing it's a compact. Yeah, it is a compact. What if I do... Hmm. Three of the... No, I don't really want to leave space. Because I'm, I'm only going to leave space when there's a new era. So I'm, I want to use all the spaces. So I'll do volume one, two, three, and then a mirror selfie. And then I'll do... I'll do the weavers. So that's two. And then the QR code with like another compact, maybe this one. And then the remaining two, I'll put on the third one. Okay, um, I won't plan it too, like, specifically because I still need to wait for my Unforgiven albums. So Girl Group is done. I'm probably gonna take a break because I still need to do three binders. Oh my god, so sorry. I still need to do three of my ults. So I'm probably gonna take a break. And then I'll just um, continue. Hello, um, this is gonna be a new clip, like a separate clip. Probably you noticed like a change in lighting and I actually organized and sleeved the photo cards. It's because I decided when I took a break from yesterday um, from filming that I would just do it today because it was already getting dark yesterday. So I decided to also sleeve the cards just so it's a little bit faster when storing them. And I also just organized them, so it's like sorted into the members already. Um, so right now I'm going to do win-wins. This is my win-win binder. It's pretty thin right now, as you can see. And it's an A5 binder. I don't really have like any specific way of storing. I like just like the rest of um what I've set up earlier in the clips i mostly do like just an order here so that's what i'm gonna do as well and i don't collect his circle cards just because i don't like circle cards personally so i only re uh, collect his regular photo cards so i guess i'll just take when wins here let's see so i sorted them out and they should be and i already sleeved them as well so like they're already double sleeve let me just check if there was a win-win that got lost no i think that's good okay so i should should i do it in order Okay, I'll, I'll put them in order and then I'll store. Let's see, so it goes fire truck. So these two. And then it goes cherry bomb, which I already have. And then empathy. I just need the reality version. It's right here. And then the regular irregular. I 
think for regular irregular i'm only missing one right yes i'm only missing this one and then the other one i already have and then regulate uh let's see i guess i already have regulate as well and take over the moon i'm guessing i already have oh no this one and then the sequel oh no I, there's the regulate card and then the sequel i think that one i already have and it goes awaken the world the thing with win win photo cards i've, I've said this in videos before but his photo cards especially after awaken the world they look very similar to each other especially kickback which is i'm which is why i'm always confused with um awaken the world and kickback photo cards because they look so similar and then past and future kino i have so many women see i only have like yeah i'm only missing three uh and then we'll go the access card you know what i actually i accidentally bought two access cards because i think this one i bought along with other photo cards and i forgot to mark it off my wish list which is why i already and then i bought another one by mistake so i'll probably just put this in front here for the meantime and then i'll probably just sell it or trade for like the cards that i don't have yet and then Arrival Kino. Stranger version I already have. Hitchhiker. Okay, here we go. Hitchhiker is this. Stranger Kino is where? I'm pretty sure I already have Stranger Kino. It's, it's probably still in the box, but I'll check. Oh no, Stranger Kino is this one. So that's... Hitchhiker, Stranger Kino, and then Hitchhiker Kino, and then Opera, and then I'll put this here. Okay, now it's in order. I'll put this in front, just cause it doesn't really have a cover, so I think this is a cute, like, addition. If I actually manage to put it in. Okay, I'm not really, I'm, I'm not a fan of the access card, like just the way it looks and the styling. Sorry, you can see the cord. Um, but I prefer like their ID cards. I feel like that's cuter, but I only have one copy. Okay, so I'll just start storing this. They're already double sleeved, which is nice. You know what? I know we just got like a wavy comeback, but I think we need another one. Like Asa. <laughs> um, dream version. Wait, do I have that one? Okay, I don't know why I crossed it off here. Oh, I see. I think fire truck cherry bomb empathy. Okay, I guess my cards are out of order. And then empathy is this and then reality but yeah um i actually did not like phantom unpopular opinion i did not like phantom and i think they deserve a repackage because wavy hasn't been active for the longest time so i feel like it's just right that they get either a repackage or a new comeback And then regulate. We got take off. I'm gonna skip. I don't have that one yet. The takeoff card, this one, I don't know why. It is so expensive. Well, I guess it kind of makes sense because um the album is out of print right now. And then the sequel, which I already have here. Awaken the world. 
and then world version. You see what I mean when they say they look similar? Like, like basically it's just the camera positioning that's different. But they're pretty much the same card. That, yeah, like you literally see there. Okay, well that was awkward. The camera fell. Okay, and we're on resonance now. So part one, past, future, yearbook. Even the yearbook looks better than the access card. And then past kino. Then future. Where are we? Departure. This one, I have actually had, I think I pulled, no, I didn't pull this on my own, but I got it from a tray. And I'm. it's always out of the binder from some, for some reason because I am obsessed with this photo card. Like, I literally put it in my, um, like, the photo card holders that I have. Or I put it on the back of my phone, which is why it's always out of the binder. <laughs> but, like, I'm trying to not do that anymore. So, like, I want to keep all my photo cards just in the binder. This one, I put, like, a post-it because I think I got this from a group order. And it was kind of skeptical because it's very thin. So I was like, is this fake? So I put like a mark just to know like, oh, maybe I should like trade or buy this card again just to see, like to compare. But I think I won't do that anymore. I think it's fine. What I don't know won't hurt. <laughs> okay, access. Departure, can you have to skip? Because I don't have, but I have arrival. And then we're on kickback now. Stranger. You know what? I'm actually glad they stopped. SM stopped doing Kinos. And um, yeah, they stopped doing Kinos. And they switched to Digipack and SM Minis. I hate Kinos. The cards go on for so expensive for no reason. Also, buying Kinos is a pain. And I feel like it's just like useless honestly and then okay i need to get refills okay, i got some um pages refills here i got i actually got my binder and the uh, like the refills from aliexpress i might link it on the description And then I guess we're in Phantom Era now. Only two cards. Thank God. Only two cards. And I got the Opera version. I know like with Lesser FM and like most of the th um, like the people I like, collect, I do like separate um, like eras. But I think it won't really work for NCT or SM for that matter. Because I feel like with NCT and um, EXO, like the people that collect Suho, Jungwoo, Win Win, they started releasing albums like around 2016, 20, especially EXO, they started releasing 2012. During that time, like albums weren't that, like there weren't a lot of version of albums. There were like two versions of each album. So you get like either two photo cards per member or like just one photo card. So like if I do that with those like SM groups that I collect, it's gonna be like one here and then just blocks and then next era. And that doesn't really work for them. But with like Lesser FM, Eugene's and like the newer groups, I feel like companies are not aware that like the, of the collecting community. So now they're like releasing more album versions or more member um more versions of photo cards for members which is why i feel like with those it works if i do like separate them by era because there there's going to be like a minimum four cards per member in an era like nowadays but it it wasn't like that so i don't think it's going to work for like my sm boys so i think i'm going to leave them like that for now now I'm gonna move on to Suho's. For Suho's, I decided to put the overdose photo card as his cover. I'll probably take it out because I have to put it inside. I don't think I have like an extra, like a dupe 
for his cards so i might buy like an extra card that i like and put it here um let's see so so okay and good thing that exo like um because I, I i'd consider exo as an older group in terms of like especially now i think they they're yeah they've been here 10 years now because they debuted 2012 so their photo cards aren't that expensive and they're easier to buy compared to newer groups Okay, so my Suho collection is actually not that bad. It's actually pretty good. Um, I'm still missing the mama, like the two mamas, and then the yearbook photo card. And then I got growl. And I'm missing one more growl. And then you go overdose. Yeah, it, you see what I mean when I say like older groups or like groups who like released albums before 20 i'd say tw even like before 2019 like they would have like two photo cards per member or even just one so if i do that with them it's gonna be like two block next era one block and i feel like that's gonna be a waste of she um pages so got overdose i'm still missing exodus yes i am i do have love me right so these are these two are exodus I got the two Love Me Right, and then Love Me Right Romantic, Sing For You is good, I'm still missing the monster, Lucky one I have, and then, wait that's kind of weird like the way I did that, okay so Lucky one and then it's Korean version of Lodo. And then it's Chinese of Lodo, and then coming over. And then we go to For Life, but I don't have both of those. So we'll skip two, and then we got The War. And then I got the private version for The War here. You know what? I'm so excited for Exos come back they announced it no i don't even know if they announced it but there were like reports about them having a comeback i think in june or july but i'm just sad that um it was just announced like i think two days ago that kai is going to the military he's enlisting because of like a change in rules apparently but he wasn't supposed to like he's still going because he's 94 but it was just like so like uh, like it was so sudden that he found out that he's going to the like he basically found out along with everyone that he's enlisting the next week and that's just and, and then considering that he, he prepared a lot like i'm guessing they prepared a lot for the exo comeback i just find it like really sad that he won't be a part of it okay and then the uh, universe but I'm just like really excited for EXO comeback. We haven't had a comeback in two years. The last one was Don't Fight the Feeling. That was 2021. It's I feel like that's long overdue at this point. Um so we're at the Don't Mess Up My Tempo. In my opinion, Don't Mess Up My Tempo and Obsession photo cards are the superior ones. Like this one I pulled by myself and I'm literally obsessed with it. Like I've taken this photo card everywhere. Oh, I, no, not this one, sorry. This one. <laughs> this one I pulled by myself. I think this one I traded. But I'm obsessed with both of them. And then we got Andante. I don't have Vivace yet. And then Love Shot. I also put it like a post-it because, again, I have a like sneaking suspicion that it's fake. <laughs> but again, what I don't know won't hurt. And we got Shot. Love shot, shot version, skip, exo obsession. As you can see, like my obsession or obsession for the cards are kind of bad. Like only have two out of the what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I, I need five still. So that goes exo, and then 
XO version, XXO, XXO again, Obsession, Obsession, Kino, and then we got Bird, and then Skip, and then Archive 1, which is a half. And I actually don't have his blue suit, uh, not blue suit, gray suit yet. Because I didn't buy the album when it got released. During that time, I was like on a K-pop hiatus. Like I was still paying attention to K-pop, but I wasn't like buying albums. Um, let's see. So, okay, I have these two. This one goes after bowl cut, and then I actually have both of them. So bowl cut goes in here. And then our, this one goes here. As you can tell, like it just goes by order. And then I'm missing his archive, like his obsession. And then pretty much all good. I'm only missing one. No, I'm missing three from self portrait. This one, and then the two keynotes. I swear to god, Kino cards are gonna be the death of me. And then I think I need to put like add extra sheets for a gray suit. He had, let me see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So I'm gonna have to put three pages. And then after this, I just need to do Jomo and my binders would be updated finally. Ow! Frick. Okay, that one's good. Like, you know what? I'm actually happy. Like, I'm satisfied with, like, how my collection has been, like, going. My existing collections, I mean. Because, like, um, my, the people that I mostly collect were mainly Jomo, Win Win, and Suho. But like my lesser fam and my new jeans ones are not doing so well. But that makes sense because I just literally started to collect them. Okay, and then I also have Jungwoo cards. I bought, I bought, like I basically bought most of these from Poco Market. And then I'll just put them in order the way that I did with um, Win Win. So I guess I'll go reality version. This one was from Poco Market. I'm kind of skeptical about it because it's very thin. Like the card, it's a very flimsy. I might buy like the same card from a person or like trade and then see like the comparison. If it's way thinner than the regular SM Mini card from this era, I'm guessing it's fake. And I'm probably just gonna put it in here. <laughs> and then if it's like the exact same i'm probably just gonna just keep both of them as well and put them there i mean i this is like my favorite one of my favorite jungle photo cards other than this this one is a pain in the oh i don't want to say it this one is a pain just like getting getting this card is a pain it's so expensive okay let's do reality and then regular irregular Okay, I don't want to use this one with the one in the mail because I can't really see the photo card. Okay, this and then regular, irregular. This one goes first and then the peace sign. Regularly, I already had. And then superhuman Kino. Where's bowl cut Jungwoo? You know what? Petition to bring back bowl cut Jungwoo. Like, that was a cultural reset, honestly. Okay, where the hell is it? I swear to God, I was literally just holding it. Oh, there it is. So I got bowl cut. And then I already have that one. I have that one. This one I have, but I put it in here. So I have to take it off. <laughs> And 
then I got Kino. I, this one I already have. This one, you're a pain. I hate you. Not him, I hate the card. Oh, I need to double sleeve this. So for double sleeving, what I like to do is like, put the card upside down like this. And then put it like this. So like the opening here, it's like completely closed off. So dust doesn't go, go inside the card. And then this one I already have. Uh, we'll see. Yearbook card. I think I already have that one. And then past Kino. Oh my god. My cards are all over the place. Do I even have that one? No, I do not. How about future Kino? I do not as well. Departure, no. ID card, I do. And then Arrival. And then his access card. Departure, Kino. And then Arrival, Kino. And then this one, it skipped because I don't collect Japanese cards for NCT. They're just too expensive. Maybe when I complete this like collection, like my jungle collection, maybe I decide I'll decide to collect uh Japanese cards. But for now, it's a no for me. Sticker. I mostly have all stickers. I think sticker for me is already complete. And then I'm just waiting for this one for favorite. And then Universe was already complete. And then I think most of the- oh, wait. I think I missed- yeah, I need to do past before the ID. So this one. And then... Most of these are AO and two baddies. These three are perfume cards. So we'll put them in order. So according to this, like I'm just literally following the order of the template. Um, let's see, photo book Korea version goes first, and then the G pack Korea version second. No, 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 the G pack first here, and then AO's last, and the perfume. <sighs> oh my god, just looking at this makes me feel exhausted because I still haven't bought any two baddies albums, that's why I'm missing a lot of two baddies in AO. Perfume I did buy, but I'm also missing a lot from there. What about the cut? I, I'm all oh my god I can't speak I'm also missing a lot of photo cards there because come on it literally just got released like two weeks ago um how do I put this in order so I'll go like box and then unit and then how many unit cards do we get three and then this is for last okay how many cards does he have two four six eight ten eleven thirteen so i need about three more sheets three more pages see this is why i don't like putting fillers it's just like too much work of taking out the filler and putting the card in Oh, speaking of perfume albums, if you haven't watched it yet, I have my perfume album unboxing up on my channel. Go watch that after you watch this, of course. Oh my god, guys, I'm becoming like a full-on YouTuber now. I'm literally like directing you to watch another video. Like, I made it. Um, and it goes regularly. This one is a, a Japanese card. Which I'm not going to collect. Sir, so I need to take this out and move this. I think I'm going to have to move most of these. And then skip for the circle card. And then I got Kino. Yeah, I'm probably going to have to move most of these. So it goes N, C...
and then it's here. And then the Kino for Neism. And then first player here. It goes second player. And then first player Kino. Second player Kino. Passed. So I'm gonna put here. And then it goes future. I'm probably gonna focus on once my Unforgiven albums arrive, I'm gonna focus on Lesser FM and Jungle only. I don't wanna like focus on multiple collections because that's just like too much. But because I heard that for Lesser FM, you want to trade as soon as possible because the cards like just they just get more and more expensive um as time goes on so it goes your book card past future kino okay since there's already a sheet there i'll put one here just so it's uniform so it goes your book past kino future kino departure And then the IB card. And it goes Arrival and then Axis. Okay, this one I'll probably do like against the grain instead of doing it in order because there's two like, I guess you could call like ID cards. I'll put it like this just so it's cuter. So it's like two photo cards are diagonal from each other, two ID cards are diagonal from each other. Um, and then we go departure Kino. And then arrival Kino. Oh my God, not this boring ass photo card. Like there's literally nothing special about it. Like there's nothing to tell me about like what area we're in. Um, and then this one is um, a skipped love. I think this is Love Holic. Love Holic. Um, those are Japanese releases, so I skipped that one. They're also expensive. I saw one card go for like fifty. That's sticky, and then it goes so. This one I'm also obsessed with. The sticker card. And then ARPC. You know what? The ARPCs were kind of fun actually when SM used to do it. I'm not sure if they still do it. I think they occasionally do. But it's not like a consistent thing. Air click card. Catharsis. And then we're on favorite, so it goes classic and then poetic kino. And then tragic kino. Yeah, poetic, tragic, and then photo book version. And then we go jewel case and then universe card and then we're into sticker so we go there jewel universe and then i think this is a perfect time to split them by era because i feel like after like during two like two bodies is when it starts like getting crazy So I'll split it by Eris here. 
So that's good. And then these are going to be for sticker. Oh no, not sticker, sorry, two baddies. Um, I'm too lazy to take these out. So I'm just gonna add like sh um, pages. I'll add all of them. Okay, let's see. Faster version, I actually have on the way. Two baddies version, I don't have yet. So we'll skip, so skip two and then we'll go photo book Korea. Photo book Japan, I have to skip, I don't have that one yet. Photo book internet, photo book. Photo book, oh my God. Photo book international, skip. So I'll have to skip one, two, for, and then Korea, Japan international and then digipack and then digipack and then digipack korea digipack japan i have to skip international skip nemo skip smc skip and then i'll put a like a failure here that's two baddies. Now we're in a year. A year. AO is going to be A and B and then Digipack and then SM Mini. And then, oh, oh my God, that's so perfect. There's eight cards. One, two, three. Oh no, there's four. And then that's AO. Now we're in perfume. Oh my God. Did I put the right amount? No, I'm missing one more. So I'll I guess I'll take this out. I don't know how I want to do the unit PCs. Because there's three of them, right? I'll probably put one here. Oh my god, the the um like the cut like the filler sheets that I have. The cuts are so uneven. <laughs> it's kind of like annoying. Okay, let's see. So we're now in perfume era. We got two, no, three boxes. So one, two, three box. What? I'm so confused. Oh, there you go. Hmm, should I do like three and then skip? No, that's gonna be like like confusing because supposedly there's only a skip when there's a new arrow so i'll do three boxes so one two three box photo book one two three i think i'm gonna do a separate like i'm gonna save the units for last and then i'll just go digipack digipack three digipacks so what did i say again so box and then photo book photo book photo book and then skip the units and then go digipack which is this one digipack and then another digipack and then do oh wait i think i did i put enough sheets on pages so one two two four six eight ten 11 13 okay i need one more okay three is will switch okay let's see so we have digipack 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 that's the third one and it goes sm mini and then the three unit PCs. Wait, hmm. I'm thinking if I should split it like three, three, like the way it's supposed to be. If I do that, it's, and then there's 13. I need to do five sheets. No, 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 no. I think I can do like box here. I'll, so three box and then a filler. And then photo books. So three photo books and a filler. Three digi packs and a filler. 
And then for the last one, it's gonna be the three units with the SM Mini. Oh, I think that would be actually cute. Compared to like just having one card here and then having all of it blocked off. Like I feel like that's gonna be that's gonna look more awkward. Okay, okay. I'll do I'll put this here first. So this one's gonna be all box. So three box. No, I'll do alternate, like alternate, like alternating. So this one's gonna be here. And then, because this is the third box version, it's gonna go here. And then instead of the start, this is gonna be at the end. And then for this one, it's going to be photo books. So black suit, white shirt. <laughs> And then skip because I don't have photo book. And then this one, I'll do like a different pattern for Digipack. I'm gonna go like this, just so it's different. And it's go. I'll go like this. And then for Digipack, it's this is the first one. And then it goes this one, this one. And then I'd say the three units with the SM Mini. So the three units I'll put in order. And that's it for Jungle. Oh my god. That wasn't too bad. That was actually like smoother. Like this took so long. I think I should and that's what like everything's lead. So I think next time I'm gonna do like, I'm gonna sleeve it before I do the video, just so it's a little bit faster. Okay, so I guess that's everything for this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you liked it, leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe, and all that stuff. So I'll see you on to the next. Oh, why did I say it like that? I'll see you on to the next. Okay, bye.